so I have my laptop with me because we're doing something laptop related. Exciting, kind of. Anyway, so I uh, actually, in a couple of days I haven't made a video, I was actually ill and I uh, wasn't at work, wasn't anywhere, I was just ill. So yeah, so I haven't gone again. Oh, I just, I just was ill. Anyway, so I'm back. Um, I feel like I say that a lot now, but no, it's only been like three days this time. Um, but if you start seeing videos not in my little filming area place, it's because my um, stepbrother has moved up here for a bit. So he's up here, like, at the moment he's out, <laughs> so I'm just coming up here. But yeah, so I'm going to have to find another place kind of to film videos because my room is terrible lighting. Um, so I don't know what I'm going to do about that, but you know, we'll, we'll get through it. Anyway, today I'm here to talk to you about, if you haven't already seen on the title, uh, festival lineups. If you don't know, I love festivals. These are my festival wristbands, which people do sometimes say, like, what, what are they? Because they never come off. Uh, Tea in the Park, V Festival, um, Leeds Festival, oh, they're all stuck together, to V Festival and Leeds. So those are those. You see them? And obviously I'm going to go to one or two or three this year. Um, and I've got the little pages up and I'm going to talk to you about what I think about the lineups and which ones I want to go to and things like that, because why not? So first of all, let's address V Festival. Here is the V Festival website. V Festival sucks because they haven't even released anybody yet. Their lineup comes out on the 25th of February, so that is 6 days, 9 hours, 28 minutes, 47 seconds according to the website. And all the others have released different things, so I'm a bit disappointed. V Festival I do like, it's like homely to me, I've been there quite a few times. And I just know my way around, it's small, it's sweet, you know. Um, and I like it there, so I would go, the lineup was good, but like I say, I don't know what it is, so that's kind of bottom of my list. My other two are that I would like to go to. Um, first being <laughs> Leeds. Um, if you don't know, Leeds and Reading Festival are the same, but obviously they're just ones in Leeds, ones in Reading. Actually, it's not quite in Leeds anyway, but whatever. So their headliners are Biffy Clyro, who I do like. He's not one of my favourites, but I'd like to see him, never seen him. Um, System of a Down, I should know who this is, I should probably look it up. Fallout Boy, I'm not the hugest fan of Fallout Boy, but if anyone else was on, I'd go and see them. Foles, who I really like, um, quite a lot of the songs I do really like, I'd like to see them. Uh, Jake Bug, who I didn't ever know of, and then I heard this one song and I loved it. And then I was like, oh yeah, cool, right, that's him. And then I saw him on the thing, I was like, oh, I know who that is. My camera's got a little weird light on, hold on, let me just check something. Oh, okay. Sorry, sorry, it's just I can actually see your reflection of the back of the camera in the TV and maybe it always has that little light. Anyway, I'm really sorry about that. Uh, Bring Me The Horizon, not my kind of thing, but you know. Eminem, love Eminem. I saw him a couple of years back um, at a festival and he was incredible, one of the best people I've ever seen. So I definitely want to go to Leeds pretty much for Eminem, but obviously they've only announced a few people yet, so. Um, Alt-J, I really like them, they're really good. I did see them last year, but I honestly don't really remember it, so. I'd like to see them again. Um, and that's kind of all it on that one. Now, Tea in the Park. I went last year. I said, I'm not going again. It was an effort. Tea in the Park is really far away from me. It's about four hours away. It's in Scotland, if you don't know. Um, and I live in England, further down. So it is like way up there. Um, but I went, I, I loved it, but I drove and it was an effort. I think I'm going to get a train this year because my god, I'm going to go. Okay, so we have Mumford and Sons, who I love, they're amazing. Not seen them, so I really, really want to see them. Rihanna, I saw her, she was good, I'd like to see her again. The Killers, never seen them, but I would like to see them, like seriously. Mr. Brightside Live, awesome. Jason Status, saw them last year, loved them, really want to see them again. It was really fun. The Script, seen them, didn't like them, they weren't very good live. I wouldn't probably go see them. Stereophonics, I've seen them. Uh, they were really good, loved it, really want to see them again. Uh, Calvin Harris, I have seen him, but I don't really remember. But um, I don't know, people like that. Calvin Harris, David Guetta, I do really want to see them. I'd see David Guetta, who is also on the list, over Calvin Harris, because I don't know at the same time. Um, but I'm not too fussed. David Guetta, I would really like to see. I didn't see him last year. I saw Kasabian, who are my favourites. So I'd obviously always see Kasabian over everybody. But um, now Emily Sandy, um, you know, she's actually quite good. I quite like her. Uh, Dizzy Rascal, not bad about seeing him. Foles, like I said, really want to see Foles. Um, so, kind of, the most people who I really want to see at Leeds are at Team the Park. So, the only reason I go to Leeds probably is to see Eminem and uh, Biffy Clyro. Alt J, like I said, the other one, Two Dot Cinema Club. I've never seen them, but I can recall. I'd like to see them. 
uh, the Coordinators. I've seen them loads of times and I always forget who they are, but I always enjoy them. And I was like, who was that? Jake Bug, like I said, the guy before who sung. Um, I knew the Lumineers. Oh my, I really, 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 really want to see the Lumineers ever since all this year of the two months that we've been. I was like, I really want to see the Lumineers this year. I wonder if they're at all. They're actually in the park. So happy. So I'm going to see them. Play my face. Labyrinth. Labyrinth. I saw him, like, he's a bit of a cheesy one. I saw him last year, it was actually pretty good. Of Monsters and Men, I really liked them. I saw them last year when they weren't as big, I didn't really know any of their music. Now, I love their music, so I really want to see them now that I know their songs. Noah and the Whale, that seems like a weird one. I'm sure they sang, like, some weirdo songs a couple of years back, but I don't think I'd see them unless they were on in the day and nobody else was. Editors, I'd like to see them. I was at a festival once, I walked past them, didn't see them, and then I was kind of disappointed in myself. Um... And then you just got some random little ones. You know, did I show you this? Look at that. There's a lot of people because it's their 20th year, so they're going a bit all out. But um, yeah. So that is that. That's my opinions on that. Now I wanted to know if you guys. I suppose it's like a weekly chat, just not. But whatever. Um, if you've been to a festival, um, if you want to go to a festival, if you're gonna go to a festival this year, what you think of festivals and all that good stuff. Because I love them. It's my favorite thing to do in the year. Uh, I'd go to a festival every holiday. Um, just because, I don't know, I just love them. But yeah, so let me know what you think. I'd like to know where you're going, where you've been, um, and just what you think of them. And if you've ever been to some and went and didn't like it, I don't know, just just post it down. Let me know, we'll have a chat. But yeah, so thank you very much for watching, and hope this video wasn't too off complete randomness. But yeah, thanks. Bye!